Amplifier swamping is a method of controlling the gain by means of external components, so that it's not entirely dependent upon the gain of the transistor. Swamping uh, is done by breaking the emitter resistor into two components, one of which is bypassed by means of a capacitor. So we're going to redraw this as an AC equivalent circuit and observe what happens. This uh, capacitor becomes bypassed, uh, becomes short rather, this becomes shorted, this becomes shorted, and of course the supply voltage goes to zero. So now we can redraw the AC equivalent circuit. R1, R2 in the biasing network. We come into the transistor. Transistor has one resistor, which is little r big e. This one over here, this one is completely gone. And of course, in the collector circuit, there's rc. And in parallel with that is rl. And uh, We'll combine these two resistors into a single resistor we'll call little r, little c. So we'd like to find the gain of this circuit. This is V in, and here is V out. And of course we have Re prime in the intrinsically in the base emitter uh, path. So voltage in, V in, AC voltage in, is equal to, and it'll be the currents flowing through this pair of resistors, RE prime and RE, times the uh, resistance. And of course that current is IE times RE prime plus RE. And at V out, the output will be the collector current, V out, is equal to the collector current times the resistance it flows through, and that is this one over here, the parallel combination of RL, RC. So now we can actually write an equation for gain. The gain, voltage gain, is equal to the output, IC, RC, divided by IE, times Re prime plus little r big E. At this point, we can notice that uh, the emitter current is approximately equal to the collector current. And uh, so these two terms here are very, very close. In fact, they're so close we can uh, effectively cancel them out. And we can now say that the voltage gain is approximately equal to Rc, the parallel combination of the resistors in the collector divided by Re prime plus the unbypassed emitter resistor. So this is the gain of this circuit. Now note that um, if the entire resistor is bypassed, if the capacitor comes here, if the entire circuit is bypassed, then the gain is uh, going to be very high. This little RE here disappears. And so just make a note of that. If the entire emitter resistance is bypassed, then the gain, AV, becomes approximately equal to simply RC over R E prime. Now this gain is very high. This is very high. A very high gain. And that's because this R E prime is a, a very small resistance. 
Now, the reason why we typically don't bypass the entire thing is that this gain is almost uncontrollable. It's very difficult to predict what it is because it's dependent upon the emitter current, and uh, so it's uh, not very, very good. The other thing is that this resistor, Re prime, is nonlinear. And that's to say it's, a, it's dynamic resistance, and so distortion will occur in this signal. So the gain is very high, and distortion occurs because of the nonlinearity of R E prime. So this is not a very good example. This gives you the highest uh, amount of gain possible. And the other extreme we could have is if we don't have a bypass capacitor here at all. So the second case is um, if there is no bypass capacitor or if um, Re is much, much greater than Re prime, then the voltage gain, uh, the voltage gain AB is approximately equal to simply RC over Re. And uh, this is often the case. This is often the case. Notice this, that the gain now is now controlled entirely by the emitter and collector resistors. And as a result of that, there's no nonlinearity here. The resistors are linear. Therefore, no distortion occurs. So this is a very common uh, condition, is to design the circuit in such a way that the gain is simply going to be the ratio of whatever resistances are in the collector divided by the resistance in the emitter. And uh, if the resistance here is um, much larger, the unbypassed resistance is much larger than RE prime, then the circuit will act as a linear amplifier and we will have uh, minimum distortion or even no distortion.